Can you give us an update, please, on Connor Golson, Ben Davies, and Ryan Jack, and any other injuries you may have? And uh, how much of a blow in particular is the loss of Connor, given he's almost a, a never present for Rangers? Yeah, well, first of all, um, um, Connor and and, uh, and Ryan have uh, they have injuries. Of course, they they they, they left the pitch on, on Wednesday and. They have both muscular uh, muscular uh, injuries, so they won't be uh, they won't be back in the in the short term. Uh, ben Davis is uh, had a knock on uh, on Wednesday, but could continue the game, and he didn't uh, pick up an injury. So we still have training today, but I expect him to uh, to be involved uh, tomorrow. Uh, of course, a big blow, you know, whenever you have uh, injuries. But uh, as you said, you know, Connor uh, played all the games since I've uh, joined the club. Only when we rested him, but uh, he was an ever presence, very uh, important player in the back with his uh, with his coaching, and uh, you know, of course, his um, you know his uh, his presence as well. Uh, so that's a big blow, you know. We. We won't have him back uh, for the next month, so um, that's a big blow for us. How many months can you tell us? I'm not exactly sure, but um, uh, it will be several months where uh, he can play. Uh, good morning, Gio. Um, good morning. With the news that you've got so many defenders out injured long term at, at the moment, is that maybe force you looking at possible free agents or anything like that to try and bolster your backline? Well, you, you, of course, when you have so many um, players injured, you look at options. You know you have in the academy uh, options may uh, you have with, within your squad, but also uh, you know look uh, if there are free agents. But you know at the moment and this time, you know the free agents are are players who who haven't uh, played a lot uh, recently or, or also come back from injuries. So. Of course, we are uh, open for any 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 uh, possible uh, uh, additions. But uh, again, you know, you have to have the right one. So for now, we're not uh, looking into uh, bringing uh, players in. Is this an opportunity then for for John, to James Stans and Leon King to become your kind of new central defensive partnership? I guess you also have the option of of putting John Lundstrom back there. Yeah. Well, we have, as I said, you, we have, uh, of course, the, your natural. Um, central defenders at the moment, you know, are Ben Davis, Leon King, and and James Sands. Then you have John Lundstrom, who who played there uh, in the past as well. So those are obviously the the, the main options at at the moment in uh, in those two positions. Giovanni, I wonder if I can quickly look back to the Champions League and, and post match. You would said how you would need to process what happened. If you had the time to do that, and, and what sort of explanation do you have at this point for, for what happened, particularly in that second half? Well, I mean, of course, the process is to, to analyse the game, analyse what happened, um, uh, what we did well, what we have to improve, and, and what we didn't well do well. As I said, you know, I think for 60 minutes we were, we were well in the game, uh, in those 60 minutes already, Needed to change two two uh, two players, of course, Connor just before before half time and, and Ryan Jack. So, you know, the, I think that impacted also the way um, we played. Um, as I said, you know, in Champions League, you have to be 90 minutes. Um, you have to be in top form to, you know, to play against the teams we are playing at the moment. And uh, if you drop your levels. Uh, you know, in the last 25 minutes, and the uh, the opponent is is only getting stronger, and, and with the subs they they made, then the difference is is very big. Although I think the the goals we conceded, you know, we we are um, we are capable in in defending those moments, but we didn't do that really well. Uh, also, you know, we have to switch back now to to domestic league and 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 to the next game. So we need to. Uh, take our positives with us because we we be playing really well uh, in in the, in the league games and also the first uh, half against Liverpool and we should take that with us to the game tomorrow against Motherwell because we are you know where we are all, we have all to play for now in in our domestic uh, competitions the league and the cup so we need to uh, improve um, you know the 
the the the the, um, the things we didn't do well in in the last 25 25 minutes and uh, continuing our winning streak in the league and that's that's our focus at the moment and you know we need to keep going forward you know be stronger and uh, that's all we have to do and that's that's our main focus at the moment. Gio, um, during your own playing career in your first season, um, you were part of a, a, a Rangers side that lost 5-1 at Parkhead, uh, a particularly heavy and damaging defeat. Um, obviously, um, you, you suffered a similar one during the week, um, but back in 1998-99, the score went on and won the treble. Um, is that the focus now, not just necessarily the league championship, but winning all the trophies that are still available? Well, of course. I mean, you know, do you, you know, because these are the game heavy defeat we uh, we had on the weekend, and you know, for me also, of course, as a manager. But you know, these are moments you have to get get stronger, improve yourself as a manager, and and learn from the things you you uh, you experience on 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 the day. And uh, as I said before, eventually you need you need to continue and to make sure you use it to. Uh, to, to move forward stronger and as I said before you know in in, in Europe it's it's quite a you know difficult for us to uh, you know to get points still we have a slight chance to to go through in in Europa League but that will also be difficult but in the league we're still in all competition and 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 we are uh, you know positions in the league where where everything's to play for so that's our main focus and as you said um, although you have uh, defeats at moments it's hard to take uh, but you have to continue and, and 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 that's what we have to do because we you know have a have a league game tomorrow to to get the three points and and on Wednesday we have a big game to to reach the semi-final in the League Cup, so it's you know it doesn't stop. All the games come really quick now, but we have to uh, get focused again, uh, prepare well, and 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 make sure we have the three points tomorrow. And um, you what's been the, the mood of the players and the, the camp since since Wednesday night? Well, of course, obviously we uh, we were in on um, on Thursday, and uh, you know talk with the players about the game, the experience they felt in the game, and. Uh, of course, also disappointed with the result, also disappointed with the differences with the first 60 minutes and, and the last 30 minutes. So that's, you know, that's how they, they felt it also uh, like, like I felt. And um, they, they have the same feeling, you know, to continue and to keep improving and uh, take the lessons we, we, we learned from the game and, and, and move on.